comes to building blocks, I'm most passionate that the children go away knowing who Jesus is and what impact he'll have in their life. Do you think Jesus wanted to die? But he needed to because he needed for you to be with God. Mostly when we're driving in the car, he starts talking about a lot of Bible stories that he learned here that is impressive to me how much he's learning about the Bible. But then secondarily would be the academics, knowing that they're going into kindergarten prepared and being able to sit in a group and function as a kindergarten student. Betsy B, Betsy B, B says ba, 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 ba. When they've had a little bit of preschool and they've already figured out how to sit in a group, sit at a table without falling out of a chair, um, communicate with the other kids without having any kind of aggression or any kind of conflict, then they're prepared for kindergarten and they don't have as much trouble transitioning. She can read right now. From ABCs to colors. She learns uh, to be nice with friends and play with them. His name, he's learned how to write his name. Yeah, she, she's, she's very social now. He's learned a lot about the Bible. Um, he's even taught his mommy a few things about the Bible. Having the four hour a day program is ideal for preschool because the kids have the time to be able to work and function in a way that doesn't wear them out and exhaust them. And they can enjoy what they're doing rather than feeling like it's a burden to them. And the parents are enjoying it more because they have a break from their children to do the things that they need to do, but then they can come back and be a family again. Even though it was a little bit further out of the way, I came back here because I just really felt that they cared for and loved my kids as much as I would. 